So today we're gonna go through this app which is called Whiteboard Widget Messaging. So here is the app. Uh, it's in the top charts in a social networking category in US App Store and I think it's one of the competitors to this really viral Locket Widget app um, where you can basically send pictures to each other home screen. So I think here with the whiteboard you can do something similar but you can also send notes, you can uh, send text uh, and also uh, images. Um, so uh, also uh, emojis, change the text color, add different backgrounds. So it's kind of more advanced. Um, yeah, so let's just open it up, see how that works. So first what you need to do, you just need to create an account in that app. Um, so you can just do that with Apple ID. I just signed up with Apple ID. However, I think that this app is available on Android. So that's actually uh, can be a, a bit of an advantage. However, I'm wait, I'm not sure. I don't, I think that's another one. Uh, so not sure if this one is available on Android anyways. So then uh, what you need to do is just need to add friends. That's how it works. So you just tap invite friends in the top left three dots. And then you can just send to people something like this. Add me on whiteboard so we can draw on each other widgets. And then it will have your whiteboard com uh, address slash profile slash your whiteboard ID. And then just your colleagues can click on that and then just add you either your partner or your friend or anyone else. Um, so that's how it works. Also, if you know your friends already are on the app and they have their username, you can just search them like this, just search by their username and then you can send a friend request. Just tap on the plus icon just for the sake of this demo and then you will be able to send a friend request here. Oops, something is not working with the app. I'm sorry for that, because a lot of these apps in this category are just, just blowing up in popularity and there are some few bugs here. Um, so uh, then you can just add them like this or you can find Nerby Nearby, you can also add from your contacts. Then there is your profile. So it's my picture. Then you can just add your picture. And as well, you can just add your username. So for example, here's my username. I can add it, I can change it. Uh, I have my account type, which is private by default. So meaning that only your friends can send you messages. Would you like to make your account public? This will allow anyone to send you messages even if they are not your friend. Um, so then you will see all your friends here and then you will see all your friend requests here as well. Um, then there are settings, but anyways, let's just go through the basics. So how this works. So I tap on the messages tab and in top right, I create, want to draw a new message. Um, so this is where the magic starts. So I can just draw this cool note uh, to my friend or anyone. And then um, I can just add also text. So that's also cool because there is another app which is called Noted where you as well can add notes like this and create widgets, but uh, it's not possible to write text. So this app is basically like a messaging app. So you can just message like this. You can create like text messages. So that's amazing. Then you can uh, change the color. So just change the different color here. And then also you can add images from your camera roll. So that's amazing because in Locket widget and in Noted app, other apps, it's not possible to uh, to add photos from camera roll. It is only possible is it to take photo and send it right away or just to draw a note. Here you can do it. And also here you can send, 
these emojis but just be careful when you just put it on the on the this drawing tab it's not possible to move it around anymore so that's basically it uh, so that's what you can add again you can draw notes you can add text you can add pictures from your camera roll but you can't take live photos so to send a photo here you just need to uh, to take photo it's saved to a camera roll and then you can just use this app if you want to instantly send photos via app you just need to use locket widget then you tap next and then here if you already added a friend then you will be able to send this message to to your friend or to a group of people i guess and then you can just send anonymously. So this is a, also a cool feature because you can send separate uh, notes to separate friends. For example, in uh, in Locket widget, I think it for, for a few moments ago it was just possible to send the same photo to to the same people. In Noted Drawing widget app, it's only possible to send it to one friend. Here it's much easier. You can just send to to more people. Uh, and you can send a different uh, picture to different people. So also that's quite cool. In the, mom, in the bottom, you have an option to send anonymously. You can send anonymous message and then just tap send. And there you have it in the top, you will see this green bar which says success message send. So that's that's basically the idea. Again, we can just go through the app tutorial uh, and then you will see uh, messages you have sent and received. Uh, message can only be sent to your friends. So that's basically you will see that someone just sent you a message and the message is not like a texting message because like what's the point of that? It's it's just a notification of you have a new note which is displayed in the widget. Then uh, you can search for people to find request. You can view your profile and then you can just draw that, add emojis. You can change the background. As I told you, tap the paintbrush icon to change the paintbrush color. You can add custom backgrounds as well that we provide or you can select your own image as a background. Once you are done drawing your message, uh, send it to one of our friends so that will appear on their widget. Uh, but that's not the ad. You also need to add widget to your home screen. Um, and to do that, just basically tap and hold. And in top right, you will see the plus icon. And then you can just search for whiteboard. So there you have it. And then you will be able just to add a whiteboard widget. And there you have it. Uh, so then if, uh, yeah, if the friend uh, uh, has this widget, he will see your note which you just sent. So that's the idea. So for example, this is a noted widget from other app, which is called Noted where you you can see as it how it looks like for example and the fun part of it is like yeah you don't need to log into any app you would you would ask like hey like i can send all of these messages on whatsapp or like you know messenger but you need to log in into your whatsapp select the recipient select the conversation here is just it instantly appears on your home screen so you can just put it on it on your home screen and then it will appear there so that's the idea you can always refresh to find new messages uh, if they are here if there are any issues you can just tap submit feedback and uh, you can always just send uh, send an email uh, support at ample svtwr.com so you can do that um, so yeah, then let's just go through the profile. So you can tap on your icon in top left and then you can just tap delete account. Are you sure you want to delete your account? And just tap yes, delete my account. And yep, so you can do that. Uh, you can block users. You can share. So 
so yeah I don't know if the sharing button works but anyhow uh, of course yeah you can also link your Instagram um, as I said before you can add your username uh, you can see all your friends and all your friends requests so currently there are not um, there aren't friend requests here also there are some things like doodle of the day which I don't know what that is so here you can just see what other people are drawing so you can like that uh, and then you can see winners who is the winner of the day and you can see that people just drawing really amazing pictures here just using this app which is really fantastic so of course there is also some scammy stuff and then uh, yeah uh, that's about it that is the app uh, it's kind of a fun app but also pretty cool to use because you can uh, surprise your loved ones you can surprise your friends and family with this app and just by installing these widgets they can get all of these uh, notifications to their home screens and start using the app so overall I uh, hope that this is helpful uh, that's basically the app if you if you are not happy with it here are a couple of alternatives so let's just go through it because I did overuse of all of these apps they are super popular right now so there is Locket widget app which you can try uh, here you can send live pictures if you just take a photo you can send it then there is noted drawing app so there you have it you can send you can use this one and then there is another one which is called widget share Uh, this one uh, I think this one is available on Android actually but not sure again so yep uh, there are a bunch of apps which you can definitely give a try uh, if you like this overview please subscribe to my youtube channel follow my blog mrhack.io I often do descriptions of cool apps and software uh, follow my podcast on spotify and see you in the next videos